Roxy, welcome back to my channel. All right, Capricorn, what is Capricorn? What do you need to know? Um, before I even started channeling this, I was channeling this um, song. Do, 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 do. Somebody wants to get it on. You may want to go listen to that song. I know you all know what that song is. Ten of Cups. Somebody, um, somebody's getting lucky is what I heard. Somebody's getting their, this Ten of Cups. Somebody definitely wants to get it on. Somebody's walking away from something. Some of you might be walking away from a relationship to go towards a new path. getting some uh, a message very soon somebody wants to come back in this could be this person walking away from something that wasn't working and coming back towards you for some of you this is someone they've been thinking about this could have been somebody that they walked away from and they want to go back to and there's a message coming in and it could be about the fact that they want a relationship with you a date with you they want to make things even Or this is you, you want to make things right with someone. You're afraid this person's going to deny you, so you're kind of scared of coming forward. This is you, you want to move forward with somebody, you want to tell somebody how you feel, you want to reveal your cup to them, but you're afraid that they're going to deny it, like you're in some of you, I heard you're in denial. Someone's being sneaky, or someone's going to try to sneak into this. Someone needs to um, release something as well. It's holding them down. Like these these swords in their hand, her hand is kind of weighing her down and stopping her. And she's dropped a couple along the way. I heard truth bombs. So somebody is going to be dropping some kind of truth bombs because they're sick and tired of holding on to these swords of truth. Um, some of you, um, this person is not going to see this coming. Somebody wants a relationship with you. Somebody realizes they, when they walked away from you, they were going down the wrong path. And they realize they need to turn around. This person wants to turn around. This person wants a turn around with you. They feel like they can work with you now. They realize this is third party interference was not helping them. Some of you, there was someone um, watching this all play out and not being was be someone was being deceitful in this connection someone saw the two of you and they wanted to remove you guys from being together like they made these plans to um break you guys up or stop this connection from working out or moving forward there was a reason for this Because there's a third party situation going on for some of you. This is why this didn't go into fruition because there was a third party involved. And until this person removed this person from their life, that third party that wasn't meant for them to grow with, when they um, removed this third party, that's when they could move forward. These were their demons that they had to deal with. These are the demons they're going to have to tell you the truth about because they weren't being honest. Yeah, before they can, these um, spirit will open the gates to this person and let them move on. They have to open up their mouth and be honest with you. They have to tell the truth. Whether they like it or not, these demons are what holding this person back. These demons are what's causing this person sleepless nights. These demons need to come out because, like I said, it's stopping them for their ten of pentacles. This is also could be causing them money issues as well. This is this person's tower moment. They're realizing in order for them to be able to move forward, or this is you, in order for you to move forward, you have to release these demons. You have to open up that closet. You have to rip off that band-aid and speak the truth because this will give you your wish fulfillment. So some of you, this is your tower moment. You're realizing that you need to speak up and speak the truth because you 
you know what you need to do. Like, I'm just hearing, you know what you need to do. This is your justice. This is justice for a queen of cups as well. Somebody it's going to have your new um, beginning. This is going to let you grow. You're going to be able to move forward with this person. You've been thinking about this queen of cups. You know you have. And some of you, you've pulled away from this queen of cups. Even though you felt like you could do more with this person, like you could have a higher commitment, you moved away from this person for the third party. And for in order for you to be able to come back and this person not to deny you, you need to be open and honest and truthful is what I heard. Or this person is going to deny you and this is going to be your own fault because you didn't tell your demons, you didn't speak your truth. Some of you are going to end up in jail and imprisonment if you do not speak your truth. You need to be kind when you're speaking your truth as well. Don't just be an ass about it for some of you. Some of you, you're better than that. You can speak your truth and do it in a kind way. So you can be very passionate and move forward, but you can do it in a kind, loving way. Don't stoop to their level is what I'm hearing. Speak your truth and be kind about it because you know this person is meant to be the one and whoever was in the middle of this is not and you're gonna take heed like some of you need to take heed so you have dreams as well you have you're having dreams of this person and the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles are right on each other and this is the deceit this has all been what's been hiding in the background that you had bigger plans with this person you saw this person from the get-go for some of you you are moving on from somebody else to be with this person but yet you stopped something stopped you in your tracks whatever relationship had you had going on maybe a marriage you had to end this in order to move forward in order to take key from your spirit guides and who you are supposed to be with some of you this is a divine pair this is somebody that you are definitely supposed to marry and you're realizing this but you had to end it with somebody else in order for you to be able to come forward because your spirit guides would not allow you to move forward without releasing these demons releasing this truth releasing these people and some of you realize that you cannot um protect everybody that you meet this was keeping you imprisoned for some of you this is what was holding you back this was what's stopping you from moving forward and offering this cup of love to somebody you thought about it you sat there you've been wanting to be with this person you've been wanting to move forward with them some of you sat there looking out the window at the moonlight or even just being outside next to water like something you sat there you thought about them sipping your cup of coffee in the morning or doing whatever it is before bed you are thinking about this person you are some of you are daydreaming about moving forward with them some of you are daydreaming of having a relationship a marriage children like you sat there and daydreamed about it some of you are actually literally dreaming about this and I feel like this was your um your eye you were seeing this spirit was sending it down these were um some of you thought these were just hallucinations they are not like i feel like you have the sight and you need to listen to it you need to be honest with yourself some of you do have the sight and stop fearing it um let go of control and just speak your truth and that's where your success will come from when you are coming from the heart and not trying to come from greed that's when your things will get better. That's when your things will start to grow when you're not out here trying to um, use this to your betterment. Spirit guides are watching you. They're helping you. They're gonna move, help you move forward. Do not cry. You are coming out of this despair. You're coming out of this money problems. Things are gonna start to work for you. Stop worrying and waiting. For some of you, you need to just move forward, get in your car and do what you need to do, get in your whatever and, and work towards you. Some of you need to work on yourselves in order for this to start to be better, in order for your heart to heal. Some of you need to move away from someone that left you crying. Um, some of you need to move away from these people who hold money or whatnot over your head. Like, you know, some of these are past relationships. You know you need to move on from them. It's over and done with. And you're realizing this. It's taking you some time, but you feel like you are stuck because of this. 
like you couldn't leave these people behind in your past but that wasn't working for you some of you you did have a marriage with them some of you you did have a family thing with them but it wasn't meant for you and now the universe is giving you something that you're supposed to be with the person they are supposed to work with don't deny this because that's going to ultimately put you up in the what you worry your biggest fear is some of you fear that you're going to die alone when you get out of this um, fearing of being alone and you start to work on yourself and don't accept just anything you guys work towards yourselves like you need to make plans for yourself and not stop, stop trying to worry about the other person you need to come in contact with like some of you have some really inner deep demons you need to deal with and when you move from that and actually work on you that's when your person your perfect person is what I heard is gonna come into to fruition this person that you're manifesting when you think about love, when you actually are truly coming from the heart, that's when things will start to work out and stop being so deceitful, stop holding yourself back, give freely, open your arms freely, open your heart freely and give love. Do what you're drawn to do. As long as you're not out here trying to hurt other people and you're truly coming from the heart and not deceitful, that's when things will move forward. Love and light.